been cloudy and rainy for most of the day today, but at least the temperatures are warm. That's the good news. Uh, it's still in the 60s. 63 at the top of the hour at BWI. And we're probably going to climb at least a few more degrees uh, as we go through the afternoon. 63 in Catonsville as well. 62 in Tawny Town, And it's 61 degrees in Rising Sun. The normal high this time of the year is 55. Already past that mark up. We haven't had too many days uh, so far this month with temperatures below average, but we got a couple coming up as we head into the weekend. I'll show you the seven day in a moment. Right now, that south wind is pumping in not only the warm air, but plenty of moisture off the bay and to the south off the Atlantic, and it's feeding into this storm system we've been talking about for the last couple of days. Right now, there's a warm front cutting right across the state of Maryland, and the main part of the system is still back in the mountains moving through West Virginia. This area of low pressure will push up into Pennsylvania later today and eventually off the coast. And I think by 6, 7 o'clock tonight, most of this rain is going to taper off. But up until that time, really just uh, more of the same as we go through the afternoon. You can see all kinds of moisture out ahead of this storm from the Carolinas all the way up through New York State. Uh, let's zoom in and take a closer look. Watching this batch of heavier showers coming up out of Virginia. So far, uh, the rain has been pretty light around Baltimore. But this batch of what I call moderate rain, not heavy rain, will come up the I-95 corridor. So as we go through the afternoon, it's likely that the rain will become a little uh, steadier and perhaps uh, a little harder as we uh, head towards uh, the late afternoon hours. But right now, there's not a whole lot happening. This is mostly just light rain and drizzle. But again, that, that heavier rain will move in uh, later today. After 6, 7 o'clock, everything will push off the coast. And then over the weekend, uh, the big chill comes in. We, again, we haven't seen this kind of air mass yet this season. Watch what happens to the jet stream. Set the time frame into Sunday evening, and you see this big push of almost uh, what we'd call winter-like air coming into the east, and the high temperatures will drop all the way into the 40s, it looks like, by the time we hit Sunday with overnight lows uh, in the 20s. So big changes coming up. Breezy and mild this afternoon, though. The high temperatures will be in the mid-60s in the northern suburbs, maybe near 70 south of Baltimore. Rain showers likely. Most of it will be light. The winds out of the south at 10 to 20 miles per hour, gusting a little bit higher than that at times. The rain showers will end early tonight and then decreasing clouds. Temperatures will drop back into the mid 40s. That's chillier than last night, but still above average. Uh, the normal low is now 36 degrees. Seven day forecast going into the weekend. Breezy and a little cooler tomorrow, but again, the normal high is 55. We'll be in that neighborhood on Friday. Another front comes through on Saturday with a slight chance for a rain shower Saturday night. Then it gets chilly. Maybe a sprinkle or a snow flurry on Sunday with a high near 47. Sunshine on Monday down in the 20s in the morning, make it up to 46 in the afternoon.